Hey guys, so it's official. Sworn yesterday afternoon. Uh, it was exciting. The actual swearing in process was was mad short actually, but um, it was good. Um, you know, I went to uh, swearing in at one. I went to Waffle House in the morning. Um, I actually went to go pay uh, the traffic ticket in the morning so I could. So I wouldn't be lying on my security form saying I didn't have any outstanding tickets or whatever. Um, so then we went to breakfast and I was trying to figure and finish filling out the rest of my uh, security clearance form and come to find out that I didn't even need it. Finish that day and have to hand it in or anything. She just wanted to make sure that I had it done, which I told her when I got there, which I got there late also. I told her that... Um, it wasn't all finished. I had a couple, couple things to do yet, and I still had a couple questions actually. So, I said that's fine. Uh, it'd be something I could ask my questions to um, at some point. So, uh, went. My mom actually came, so that was cool. Uh, the chief was there, and one of the other guys that works in the unit that I'm going to be working in, so that was cool. Let's talk with him a little bit. I had to go and fill out some paperwork when I first got there. Um, um, you know, like the life insurance stuff, and, you know, the policy on me, if I wanted to have a policy on any other family member. And some of my wife, in case something happened to her. Um, yeah, it's just a, a bunch of paperwork and information about the kids, and you know, if something were to happen to me and my wife, then it would happen. I did that stuff, and then it's finally time to swear in. Just went into this room. Um, they had like a flag over in the corner. I'm not sure if I'm gonna. Um, attached the video of the swearing and I recorded it. My wife recorded it for me. I'm not sure if I'm going to attach that to the end of this one or just post a separate video. But, um, yeah. So, did that and then after that then went back downstairs and had some more paperwork stuff to do. Like, um, we were on speakerphone with the person from, uh, I guess... I don't know, she was telling me about the, like the GI Bill and she had to talk me through signing the contract and stuff like that. <clears throat> so she just went through that, explained kind of how it worked and you know I got a signing bonus so kind of talked about that and qualifications and you know if you, well, I'll make another video about that maybe. If anyone's interested just let me know and then I'll make a video about how the signing bonus works. Um, but yeah, so we did that, and then we would have been free to go, but like I said, I had those questions about the security clearance stuff, so <clears throat> she said that um, once, on well, like 14, 10 or 14 days, something like that, the person from the department would give me a call, and then I'll have like a log, and I have to do it online, I should go and fill out the, the stuff myself, and I have to get it done within five days or something like that. Or everything gets reset and I have to start over and whatnot. So hopefully I get that notice and I get it all done. And hopefully I finish my form before that. But yeah, so I went up, asked my questions, and then we bounced. But yeah, so the next thing I have my drill is January 10th and 11th. And I guess the way ours works is I drive myself there and then... I guess we're done around three or something like that, so I drive back home. You know, I was under the impression that we had to go up and then stay there for the weekend, but apparently we don't. So I guess that's good. So I'm not really looking forward to getting up earlier and having to drive there. 
It's like 45 minutes away to get up and get dressed. So, yeah, still, still going to be early, so I'm not really looking forward to that. But I am excited to go to my first drill. I was disappointed. The only free thing I got was this folder with a bunch, well, not even a bunch. It has, like, the right start. Pennsylvania Air National Guard right start packet. It's like all the information that we're going to need to know for like boot camp, like rankings and symbols. And in the back, there's like a chain of command. And we've got like drill and ceremony stuff, like commands, at ease, right face, about face, all that stuff. And then there's like the chain of commands that I have to learn. Know, who's who, and then the back of it there's a drill schedule. You can't see, but <clears throat> it gives you the drill schedule for for the year. So that's cool. I'll do that to my job, so they know when not to schedule me for the weekend. And then it has like the contracts and stuff that I sign my copies. Information about the GI Bill. But I didn't get any T-shirt, no hats, no keychains, no pen. Nothing. My kids got some free stuff. You got like a teddy bear or football. You got like a puzzle. A little mini flag. American. I didn't even get an American flag. The kids got a flag. Yeah, so I didn't get any free stuff. I had to keep going. Edit this. My wife called and I was trying to finish my video. But um, yeah, so... I was like, where's my free stuff? I don't get any free stuff, nothing, I had nothing. So I got, I'm getting a backpack, but it isn't in yet. It has my name on it, so we'll see. That's going to be pretty lame if that's, that's it. I'm getting nothing, but that's all right. Um, so yeah, so that's the next thing is just going to drill. And then once I go to drill student flight, whatever it is. I have to meet with the trainer there, I guess, and we'll be able to figure out um, a ship date. I have to figure out what when the classes line up for my for my job, and be able to figure out a ship date from there. And I'll give you guys the update. Alright, I will talk to you in the next video. Like, subscribe, um, comment, and, uh, let me know if anyone else is picked your job, swore in yet, if you're interested in a job, any questions, getting pretty far along here in the process, had to go through a lot, so had to learn a lot throughout the whole process, so I will probably have an answer for you, unless it has to do with boot camp, since, uh, or basic training, since I haven't gone yet, but yeah, uh, just give me a holler. <laughs> All right, you ready for this? Yeah. You're actually standing right over there, that way they can get a picture. Okay. I'm going to ask you to raise your right hand and repeat after me. I, state your full name. I, Brandon Jamar Watson. Do solemnly swear. Do solemnly, solemnly swear. That I will support and defend. That I will support and defend. The Constitution of the United States. The Constitution of the United States. And the state of Pennsylvania. And the state of Pennsylvania. Against all enemies. Against all enemies. Foreign and domestic. Foreign and domestic. That I bear true faith and allegiance to the same. That I bear true faith and allegiance to the same. And that I will obey the orders of the President of the United States. And I will obey the orders of the President of the United States. And the Governor of Pennsylvania. And the Governor of Pennsylvania. And the, and the orders of the officers appointed over me. And the orders of the officers appointed over me. According to law and regulations. According to law and regulations. So help me God. So help me God. Congratulations. Thank you.